Well, welcome back to Ricketts Reef. Uh, this update, this little clip I'm going to do is on bulk reef supply. The reason why I'm going to do a little video on bulk reef supply is because it has greatly helped my reefing experience. Um, what I'm going to do here along with talking about the actual website and their products and their services is also take you through one of my orders that I've just placed with them. Uh, it's a little different for me though for most of my subscribers because I'm from Canada. Bulk Reef Supply is primarily an American company but I do like them even from Canada because uh, they take Canadians into consideration. They have a part of, as part of their shipping they deal with brokerage fees and a lot of the hassle that some of the other American companies give Canadians. So their shipping is actually somewhat reasonable for Canadians, which is which is huge because you know where I am in the very middle of Canada, it sucks for getting stuff here. We have something like three local fish stores, two of which are okay. Uh, the other one is ugh, just yeah, not so good. So anyway, we got to order a lot of our stuff from the internet. For dry goods, bulk reef supply is pretty fantastic. Uh, another thing that it does is it helps you learn. And this is this is huge because a lot of the other websites don't do this. They just have products. But if you've ever been on bulk reef supply, there's a couple of things you'll notice. One is they've got these these pretty awesome informative videos down there and they've had them for a long time. So if you go to Bulk Reef Supplies website, check out their videos. They've also got a YouTube channel, which I highly suggest you subscribe to. Um, they come out with videos on a regular basis. A lot of the stuff they talk about is well-researched, well-informed, and honestly, you're not going to get much better information. The other thing they have is this reef calculator. I'll just kind of click on it. And it helps you uh, organize your system's dosing. You know, you plug in your, your your tank gallons and you select your supplement and your recipe and so on and so forth. All of which you can purchase from Bulk Resupply, all at fantastic prices. Um, that is one thing coming in my order, which I'll be showing in, in a second. And it's just, it works. <laughs> like there's, there's nothing else to really argue with. It works. It's affordable, it's fantastic, the service is great. Every time I've sent Bulk Reef Supply an email, they've gotten back to me in a very timely fashion. Um, and they're all about word of mouth. So I'm kind of doing my part here as well as telling my subscribers that if they need to order something, check out Bulk Reef Supply. Check out their chemicals, check out their hardware. Uh, incredible prices, good prices, and if you do group buys, you get even better prices. Anyway, carry on you know the website well laid out actually this is the this is a newer version of the website they had one not too long ago I think they switched it up and this one offers point system which is pretty cool um, other than the point system it's really easy to navigate this website they've got the drop down menu with the sub menus and you know I can tell you because I used to be a computer programmer at one point in my life uh, specifically a web programmer that is a very good site it's highly functioning uh, it's got a good cart you know, I've done e-commerce it's got a, a good back-end system that's solid and reliable I've never had a problem with the website itself uh, the items are always updated either in stock or out of stock which is really nice I hate it when I order something and two days later I get an email saying sorry we're out of stock for the next four months um, so yeah, it's a, it's a highly functioning website, well laid out, easy to use, good cart. Uh, so those of you that haven't checked it out, bulkreefsupply.com. Uh, they've got sub, they've got their categories, RO filters, that's where I get my RO filters, guaranteed. That's where I get my carbon and GFO, that's where I get my supplements. Uh, I've gotten some additives there before, but they don't ship fish food to Canada anymore that's just regulation and law they've got rock if I lived there I would get rock but the uh, the shipping fees probably too much for Canada and I also make my own rock um, pumps I have ordered I think a maxi jet from them uh, nothing major yet test kits 
got some stuff there, got my fragging clippers from there. Uh, yeah, so really good site. I've got a lot of stuff from there. Never been disappointed with their products. And, you know, they've got a good rating system and review system on their site. So actually look for my reviews on products I've ordered on their site. If you're uh, browsing around, I'm going to title them by Ricketts. So that's the website part. And I will get to the next part in a second. Alright, the next part of this BRS review is the shipping. Um, I received my package uh, just over a week and a half after it being shipped. Um, I was expecting a little quicker. I've actually gotten packages quicker from BRS before, but that's not BRS's fault. That's UPS. Uh, UPS, yeah, they don't seem to choose the greatest routes. In fact, this package went all over the United States and went totally to one end of the country in Canada and then had to come all the way back across the country to me. It was just, just watching it travel, I could feel the gas being wasted. But anyway, uh, yeah, not a, not a direct route to me, but again, not BRS's fault. That's kind of a UPS deal for having really bad shipping routes, but whatever. So anyway, package came in a whole bunch of these nice styrofoam things, security, protection, doohickeys, uh, everything seemed fine, I've dug through, I've, I've actually poured it out, made sure that I, I can find all my items, and my items are here. So I got a whole bunch of stuff, I got a couple of those BRS dosers, there they are there, got a couple of them, one for my calcium, one for my alkalinity there. I'll probably just add the magnesium um, to my top off or like my water change water or just add it in once a month somewhere around there. Uh, magnesium is usually a little easier to maintain than the, uh, the calcium and the alkalinity. So that's that. One day I might get a magnesium doser but I didn't have the money. Next of it, well as you can see I got bulk packages of the chemicals and those should last me quite a while. Um, I got a Hanna phosphate checker just to check things out, keep things on the level because it is really hard to get an accurate measurement of the phosphates in the tank with one of those API test kits or one of those color test kits that you read the different, you know, pink, light pink, lighter pink. You know, it's just it, really hard for me and I gave up on checking phosphates with one of those tests a long time ago. So those things got good reviews and they're quite inexpensive compared to the old digital phosphate checkers. I got some of the the mesh stuff, the clear mesh that BRS sells for covering your tank, especially for the frag tanks when I get those up and running. Uh, if I get small fish in there, small wrasses or something like that, uh, I don't want them jumping out and I also don't want the light to be blocked out by something like egg crate. I got some tubing that will be for my new automatic water change system that I'll be using with my Apex. I've also got a whole bunch of other plumbing parts for that system. I've got some bulkheads uh, for my frag tanks. I got a new, a new float valve for my new brute tanks that will also be holding all my water, water change water, auto top off water, and I'll show you those in another update. Got a aqua scraper there. I think it's made by JBJ, a 4-in-1 cleaning kit. It's got a gravel cleaner. It's got a couple types of glass cleaners. It's it's pretty handy sounding tool. Um, see over there. I still got a little bit of the green stuff on the side. The snails are making good work of it and it's coming out now now that my skimmer's working again. But I'm just gonna give it a scrape anyway. Also the gravel rake sounds interesting. Got some tubing, just to set up my RODI system a little differently. Uh, I've got a solenoid there, but that's that's not for me. That's for a uh, that's a friend, a local reefer. He kind of went in on the order with me. Uh, I got a new glass drill bit. The reason I got that was because glass drill bits only last about 25 to 30 times ish. Um, I've done about 30, 20, 30 drills with my old glass drill bit and I can notice it is dull and it is not cutting like it used to, it's not going through the glass 
I've actually broken a few pieces because of its dullness. Luckily it wasn't anything special or, or unique. It was just some little pieces of glass uh, for something random. So yeah, got a, new, got a new bit before I started drilling the bottom of those frag tanks. I wanted to make sure I didn't snap the glass. So that's it. That's my order. I actually got those two cups. I don't know why I got those. I didn't order those. Maybe they they come with the, uh, the two this kit or those things or something like that. Uh, I haven't read all the details on what I've ordered to find out whether or not I should be getting those. There is actually one thing missing. I ordered an extra 25 test kits for the phosphate checker, but they are not here. Um, Luckily, it's it's not an essential piece. The kit comes with five tests, so I will contact them, and I, I would assume that uh, you know, judging by the support and communication I've had from BRS so far, that they'll probably send me out a new one. You know, just got to open up those lines of communication and not get too stressed. Had it been a, a item that I really needed for what I was doing, it might have been a little more stressful. But luckily, it's it's just a small item. And it's understandable that, that it gets missed because uh, compared to the rest of the order, it's kind of insignificant. So no big deal. Send them an email, get it cleared up, and they're pretty open to that kind of communication in my experience. So that's my BRS order in a nutshell. Uh, stay tuned to see how I implement these orders into my tank. All in all, bulk reef supply, in my opinion, is one of the main places for reefers to check out to order from even if they're from Canada. Uh, they do consider Canadians and that's pretty awesome. One thing else I forgot to mention about the website um, there's not a lot of like or, or there's no pages that say under construction. So yeah it's a fully functional website. Uh, I get really tired of going to some of the websites out there that you know click on something and you hope the product will be there and you get an under construction page. As a web designer, an old web programmer, that really irritates me. So hats off to BRS for their fully functional website, their good support, their information, their guidance. You know, a well-rounded company for this hobby that I fully appreciate and support. And hopefully you guys will get the same kind of experience with them. Alright, talk to you later. Comments, questions, always welcome. Later.